Welcome back, y'all. Today, I'm going to show y'all how to get the plus four badges and rebirth. Yes, rebirth is already in NBA 2K23. As you guys see right here, my build is called a hybrid defender. This build name is wild. But this is not the first build I want to drop for y'all. I have a crazy build that has 17, 22, 22, and 17 badge spread. It is disgusting. You guys are going to want to see this build. If you want me to upload my build right away, get this video to five thousand likes and let's get into this all right so look when you start up your my player you are going to hit start and go over to your quest on your quest you're going to see something that says welcome to the league literally all you have to do is keep doing the welcome to the league and all you have to do is keep playing my team you're gonna have to play around seven games in total right you just keep doing the quest and all that and you will get the plus four badges i'm going to show you the clip right here there's nothing there's no tutorial to show you on this because you're literally just playing my career and doing the quests that pop up on the screen but as you see you will be able to put plus four badges in separate categories or one category whatever you want to do on 2k23 this is huge for your build and also huge for when you're going to make your build because then you can say okay actually i don't i don't need that many badges in this category because i can just get the plus four in my career okay the next one is the ronnie 2k rebirth quest the one that you probably clicked on this video for yes it's already in the game as we speak right now you want to go to your quest go down to side and you will see rebirth now, as you guys see, I've already reached 65, reached 75. Now I've got to get to 88 to get the shirt. The next one is Rebirth. I'm going to show you guys because you have to go find Ronnie 2K in the city. It doesn't show you where he's at or anything. Every location that we know of so far. And then we've only got one more to do and we got Rebirth, which I will put in a next video or make a complete video again showing you how to do the entire thing. But I'm just letting you guys know Rebirth is in the game. And I'm going to show you how to do the first three steps. Then there's going to be one more, which I will, of course put in another video like i just said so you're gonna want to go over to your map which is hitting select right next to start and actually we're already really close to where you're gonna meet ronnie 2k you're gonna meet him right here make sure you watch this because you're gonna have to find him multiple times and it doesn't show you where ronnie 2k is so we've already got that it's gonna be right here he is right next to the north side knights park in the middle between those three buildings and the park so you're gonna have to go up to him and talk to him and he's gonna give you a reward then you got to find him again he's gonna give you another reward and like i said guys once i get up to that overall i'm gonna throw a short clip in a very like upcoming video that way you can just watch that and boom you're gonna have the entire thing but i just wanted to let you guys know rebirth is in the game and where to do the first challenges so you just walk up talk to him it's a long cut scene and then you will get a reward okay so as you see the cut scene is going to end then you're going to get a reward now the next one one is also extremely important because that is where as you see you're going to get the spawn low occasion so not only is the city 30 percent smaller then you have the fast travels now you have the spawn locations you can put on as well so you finish the quest and again you'll see it says find ronnie 2k in the city so as long as you have your overall up it's going to give you the next one again and as you see find ronnie 2k in the city the next one is the spawn location so guys drop a like on this video i mean who is giving rebirth out the freaking day the game comes out you know what i'm saying and i'm all like i said i'm gonna update you with the last two quests or the last one as soon as we get to that overall it's gonna be in a video just a short clip coming up in a in, you know in a video that's coming up in the future so the next one you want to do is find him at the mall of course we're not gonna just show me skateboarding all the way down there but once you get over here to the mall he's gonna be in one of the shopping centers now this is very important like i said the spawn location is gonna save you a lot of time the biggest thing about the city that people people complained about was the fact that it took so long to go from place to place sometimes you know without using the uh the fast travels and all that type of stuff so now you're able to really just move around the city a lot faster and it's smaller on top of that it's looking good guys comment down below is nba 2k 23 looking like a w game let me know in the comment section w or l game i've literally seen like a, just a few part games like i've barely seen any actual gameplay because look i told you guys i'm gonna be grinding so right next to that west mall you see it right next to west mall right outside embellish you're going to find ronnie 2k don't ask me why i have a hot dog on my head bro they're they are making you go out here and do a whole bunch of quests on 2k 23 my career but hey 
there's going to be even more things we find out so you already know to hit that subscribe button because this is not going to be the only thing you're going to have to do in my career it is going to be a good year hopefully hopefully we haven't seen maxed out badge gameplay you know on the game so as you see once again now it's going to say you reach 75 overall you're going to hit a and boom Look at it. Look how nice it looks. Congratulations. You have unlocked custom spawn points. You now have the ability to spawn in various parts of the city. Go to the map to view available spawn points and set your preferred location. All right, guys, this is important right here. Another one where you have to find Ronnie2k in the city. This time, again, he is close to the north side nights. He's going to be right in front of that little skyscraper where that, uh, that building starts. And then there's a building on the other side as well. So you want to go in the middle right there now i want to tell you guys something important about 2k23 as we're going to skateboard because we have time and i need to tell you guys this anyway so in my career when you move your difficulty setting to earn your badges this year it's going to show you that you're able to earn more so like if you play on rookie which rookie is back you're going to get 30 percent progression and i think it's all the way up to 160 percent on hall of fame then they even have a new difficulty called semi pro at the moment I'm finding the best, at least on this build, that is a slasher. Yes, I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys it is a slasher. But the next one, the one that I'm actually going to upload on YouTube first, is crazy. It is a do-it-all type of build. Anyway, what I'm saying is, as a slasher so far, semi-pro is the best one that we can do. Because if you go too far up, bro, the computer is crazy this year, especially when you do not have badges. So you have to be careful out there. You really have to be careful. I told you guys, I'm grinding 2K23 for you i'm literally gonna have the best jump shot best triple moves best builds how to get rebirth all that stuff on this channel okay all you got to do is be subscribed and have on notifications and you're gonna be good as i was telling you guys the entire year with the news videos for like the last two to three months so you're gonna pull up on ronnie right here and then now you're gonna complete another part of the rebirth so it's just gonna keep doing it as you guys see it's a recurring theme. You find Ronnie2k. He gives you a cutscene. Then he's going to give you another quest. But you can see the rewards is almost done. The next one is no shirt and then rebirth. So we have two more to figure out and rebirth is completely done. But like I said, the video is to show you that rebirth is not only it's in the game but you can already do the challenges and where to get the first ones of course i'm not like a 95 overall i'm guessing it's going to end at like 95 so once i get to like 95 i'm going to show you guys the rest of it in a video coming up like it could be a best jump shot video and i'm going to have it in there just for a few seconds for you guys to be able to get that you know what i'm saying but anyway you pull up on ronnie you have cut scenes of hell it's just going to keep going and now you have your shirt off actually so there's one more my fault so i have to get to 88 that's done shirt off then one more rebirth and we are done okay we are done you're gonna have rebirth fully unlocked so that is coming in a video soon guys make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new drop a like if you haven't yet it's your boy badge plug you've been plugged in and i'm out peace